Hello everybody, I'm Yolanda aka Creative Mommy of Two and welcome! As you see by the beautiful image I have laying here, I have a review. I have finished this beauty yesterday, the 4th of uh, September of 2022. And as I'm seeing this correctly, the view is pretty off. So. That's a bit better, I think. <laughs> Something like this. You see most of it now. <laughs> yeah, I finished this beauty. So, yeah, I thought I'll share with you what my thoughts were. So, yeah. So here we go. This is Evening Entanglement. This is from the amazing artist Randall Spangler. But you most likely saw that by this beautiful dragon. I believe the one with four bubbles on its tail was Dagmar. But I'm not completely sure. It's Dagmar, Dagmar and otherwise it's Dewey. It's one of those two. <laughs> if you know, you know. But yeah, this is Evening Entanglement. I started this beauty on the 13th, 13th of August and I finished her yesterday, the 4th of September. And yeah, I love this one. This one actually will be framed. I'm not completely sure when, but I will frame this one. I think I'll um, glue it over a canvas, but I'll need to see what the measurements are. And then this one will be hanging in my bathroom. I also have the companion piece for this, or at least I make it a companion piece. I have um, no more dragon's breath as well. And yeah, it will come hanging in the same bathroom. And yeah. So for the information on this kit, this one was a well, is a square. It is 56 by 56 centimeters big. It has 48 colors and four of them are ABs. As I said, it is from Diamond Art Club. Well, at least I don't know if I said it, but it's from Diamond Art Club. And as I do know, I said it's from Randall Spengler. It's one of his amazing dragon kits. So, yeah. I'm going to show you all my leftover drills, which are here. And there was not a color that I was afraid of, of running out of. I did have a few that I was like, well, they aren't a lot left, but they were also the, not the biggest colors to start with. So. Let's see, the ABs in this kit, in this kit, are these ones. Uh, if it wants to focus properly, but 101, 126, and 134. These are the ones I have smaller amounts of and I also have a bigger container of 141 because yeah this was a pretty big one it had a pretty big amount of 141 because all the floss is all AB it's all the white AB also here on the lid I need to use my other finger because I cut myself <laughs> before I hurt myself even more so yeah I'm a bit awkward today, so. <laughs> but yeah, on top of here on the floss box, it has a bit of white AB in the eyes. There is a bit of white also a little bit here in the mirror and some of the hairs in the toothbrushes. A little bit on top here and a few over here. Also, the toes have a little bit of AB magic. The uh, 101, the blue one, what here in these gems. A few in the eyes, but like three 
in one eye and maybe not even 10 in the other. So, and then a little bit here in the background. Just to give it a little bit of a pop. The 102, which was the 102, 126, sorry, which was the pinkish one. We have a little bit in the floor. The toothbrushes also have some pink. The tooth toothbrushes on many places have like a stripe of white and then a stripe of the pink underneath and white and pink, etc. Also here in the mirror, it has a lot of the pink AB as well as here, here these stripes. Also here on its leg, it had a bit of pink on the tail. Also a few in this eye, debating if those two are also white or not, for the pink ones or not. But yeah, and then we have the fourth AB, which was the green one, the 134, which is pretty common with these beautiful dragons. It has a little bit over here on its nose, its forehead, a little bit in the greenery, in this gem over here and also in this green toothbrush. So those were the main areas where the different ABs were. Let's see, did I have colors that I mixed up? Yeah, there were two that were pretty similar that you might confuse. They were at some points, depending on the lighting, a bit harder, but in other lightings it was good, so depends a bit on how quickly you confuse them. But they were these two. As my camera wants to focus. Oh, come on. There we go. It's a U and a V. So they were pretty similar on canvas color. So, yeah, that was the one I needed to look out for the most. But yeah, all in all, I really love this image. And I need to focus you back out again. <laughs> so yeah, it went pretty quickly. It had a decent amount of color blocking, so I could use my multiplacer a lot, but especially, again, wrong hand. This piece here, it has a lot of, not as much confetti, it did have quite a lot of the same colors, but as you see, it's like stripes, like blocks almost, that needed to be filled in with different colors, and yeah, it made it a little bit more work, but looks amazing. Because yeah, also, look at the shine. Especially at the left bottle, you can see it really, really well. But yeah, I think this one turned out amazing. I'll link it down below if it's still available. I haven't checked in a couple of days at least. I believe I checked if it was still available when I started this diamond painting. If it's still available, I'll link it down in the description box, but it is in the last chance selection section. So in case you like this image as much as I do, but yeah, look at it. Then, yeah, you might want to snag it now. It's still available. But yeah, it's a cutie. But let's be honest, random spangler dragons are just cuties. So, yeah. I'm gonna stop swooning over this one. I'll just move it over to whenever I get around to it to, well, hang it up. And, yeah. I hope you liked this video. If you did, you know the drill. And I hope to see you next time. Bye.